All right, guys, what's going on? It is a new day, and today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different than usual. But first, let me just check the RXA real quick and make sure that there's no new scratches or cracks or anything like that on the car. Just making sure no one hit it when it was street parked last night. And I think it's okay. This has become like a new morning routine for me whenever I leave the house now. Just make sure nothing hit the RX-8 while I was parked. But uh, I was parked under a tree, so you know, there is there's quite a few attacks by the birds on the car. But we will go wash that soon enough. But today, we're not driving the RX-8 today. This, we're driving something a little bit different. And um, there's no better way for me to say it than to show you guys. So let's go. All right, guys, today we're driving R30. No, I'm just kidding. I can't even say that with a straight face. We're driving the C4, but damn, this R32 looks nice though, huh? Every time I see a black R32, I just think of the one from Initial D. It's actually so nice. <laughs> Maybe someday, one day, but you know, I'm not even gonna think about it until I get the RX7. But we are picking up the Corvette at Crown. All right, guys, and uh, yeah, we are driving a C4 Corvette now. So there is still a lot of issues around the Corvette. I know when we dropped it off at the shop, we said we were gonna let Crown take care of everything, but the bill just came out to be a little bit too expensive, but we did get a full diagnosis. So we know exactly everything that's wrong with the car now. And what me and Sean's gonna try to do is try to fix it up ourselves. Now, it's so nice seeing the RX-8 and the Corvette back to back because they're so differently in design. They're so different in design, but I am in a little bit of a rush, so I can't, you know, sit around too much and uh, and enjoy the views because I actually got to go to work. And uh, I'm going to be dri driving the C4 Corvette to work today. And it's kind of cool. It is, it's a bit weird, but you know, uh, I'm always down for a new experience. <sighs> Man. All right, let's uh let's get a start on this car, man. Everything in this car just feels so different. And look at the look at the pedal placement, guys. You see that? Look, I was trying to heel toe went on my way back here, right? And it's just not happening. There's the wall right here. You can't heel toe. You would have to like you know side foot that. You know what I mean? So um the car is definitely really really interesting, and I'm um, still trying to get used to it. But I do need to drive this car to work because I need to drop it off at at Sean's place tonight. Where is the ignition, oh man? can't find a hole <laughs> clutch in and you know the nice beautiful digital dash <laughs> and it starts right up man v8s man they sound cool they sound cool but uh sean is in austin right now for a business trip so that's why he's not able to pick up the car so you know i'm gonna pick it up for him and you know i, don't, I definitely don't mind that at all Alright guys, merging onto the freeway in the C4 Corvette. <laughs> it is so different than like what I'm used to. I'm used to driving a rotary. This is a V8. <laughs> They're not similar at all guys. And just having it like being in a car from the 80s, it just feels feels cool. You know what I'm saying? Like just being in this car just makes you feel like a badass. Like I, I don't know how else to describe it honestly. It just feels good. Like everyone's staring at you. You're in this low American muscle. Is Corvette even American muscle? I, I would say it is. Man, I'm gonna have to sit through this traffic in a V8. Uh, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this exit here. Let's see how it does on this turn. <laughs> I mean, hey, it's pretty well. I'm only in second gear. Like the gearing is pretty tall on this car. I think I could hit like 60 in second. Let me. Oh, forgot. Downshifting is, I mean, rev matching in this car is not easy. <laughs> yeah, this thing is fun. This thing is fun. The mirrors are so small, too. Like, you know, you can't really rely on them. Man, it really sucks. Am I really gonna have to sit in traffic on my way to work? You know what is okay because you, you can listen to this v8 all day but like i said uh before right this this car does have an exhaust leak near the mufflers so the car does isn't normally this loud you guys are just hearing the exhaust leak we are gonna try to fix that sean already ordered the exhaust we're waiting for it to come in before we put it on so it won't always be this loud but i'm not gonna lie it sounds pretty good the way it is right now <laughs> I mean, I don't 
don't think it sounds the best in the world. It's definitely not like that. It sounds like a really old V8, not like the V8s that we're used to hearing online, right? Like from the Camaros, Ford, Mustangs, and stuff like that, Challengers, etc. It, it definitely sounds like an older V8, but it has like a charm to it. All right, guys, I just got to work. Normally, when I drive to work, I do look for free street parking, but you know, since I'm driving Sean's Corvette, and you guys know my luck of street parking, right? I'm gonna just pay for the parking lot right here just to avoid it having anything happen to this Corvette while it's under my possession. But while I'm parked here, you guys can really see how dirty this car is. I don't know if we'll pop up on camera, but there is like dust all over the Corvette. And Sean just honestly doesn't drive his car enough. Shake my head, Sean. If you're watching this, go wash your car and drive it. But I don't know. If I have time, maybe I'll wash it for him today. But I am rushing to work, so let me, um, I'm gonna pay for the parking right now, turn off the car and we'll get to work. But man, this, this car is such an event to drive. Yo. It's, <laughs> it's new. <laughs> it's new, right? <laughs> you like the, you like the RX-8, bro? You like the RX-8? <laughs> yeah, that side doesn't come all the way down. <laughs> Got Jason over there. It's, it's small, <laughs> Right? I was, I was telling Jason, yo, I got a little surprise for you today. <laughs> bro, this is the car that keeps dusting me on the tokens, bro. This is the car, man. We finally got it on the beat. <laughs> it's the car, man. Fucking on um, stock suspension and everything. You know, just leaving me and Jason in the bus, bro. <laughs> At least you get to see the front of it. Hey, don't expose me like that, no. Not me. <laughs> I'm catching up. Okay, okay. I, I just need to get better. Like, Alright, Sean, since you don't take your car out to like any car meets or anything, or you even drive it, you know, I'm doing it for you today. Hopefully, if you're watching this video, you enjoy the people looking at your car, you know. You, you did good there, but please drive it. <laughs> wash it. Wash. And wash it. Everyone's telling me to wash the car. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. That's not his fault. It's your fault. You were the one who took it here. No, 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 no. no. I, I only literally had it for like a day, <laughs> alright? You were chose to take it here dirty. That's not his fault. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so. Right, to refill a C4 Corvette, first you gotta open the little flap here, pull up, oh man, it's dusty. Is that a cockroach? Oh no, it's leaves. <laughs> <laughs> it's leaves, I thought it was a cockroach. And then, just, you can't siphon the gas because there's a little key here. Let's and then it's gonna, it's gonna hiss, it's gonna hiss. Which way? <laughs> Lefty Lucy, righty baby. You hear that? <laughs> Smell it. I'm gonna just stand back. Here you can right there. Oh, and then there's a spot for it right there. Oh, that tells you how much horsepower. You know, 240 horsepower, and then 335 foot pound of torque. That's a lot. That's a lot. You know, I, I I was saying last night. I was saying last night. Sean's car was a little dusty, but you know, <laughs> show them mine. You know, bad lighting, but. I am also a top contender in dusty car. Bro, I could write dirty car in your thing too. I wouldn't. Because there's way more bird shit in your car. I love doing this. I didn't have to do this in a Corvette. I almost forgot what it's like for a second, you know? You love doing that? Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> hey, well, oh, go. thank God that uh, this thing starts right up. Alright guys, uh, it is currently nighttime. If you guys can't already tell, the sun has set. We're currently in um, New Jersey. I have the RX-8 here. I don't know how well you guys could even see it, but you know, I'm just using my... Bro, I swear to God, I just heard something in the woods there. This is high key kind of sc scary. This is how horror movie starts. And you know what's freaking crazy? Sean... I'm here with Sean. He's like, let me go take a walk in the middle of the dark. I can't see anything. And he's just like, let me go take take a walk real quick. And now I can't see him. And this is hella creepy. So I don't know. Sean's gone. Sean! All right, yeah, if this is how the horror movie starts, man, I'm hiding in my car. And <laughs> we're waiting for Jason. But... <laughs> This is hella scary. All right, um, this is hella sketch. I'm gonna put the flashlight down, look at this. You guys can't see anything. Well, you guys might be able to see the, the illumination from my dash, but it's literally it. And then there's a car coming. 
Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't, I, I don't know. Sean's gone. If we die, um, you know, it is. You know, um, it was, it was nice knowing you guys. <laughs> that might be. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Coming in hot, bro. All right, guys. Uh, we're following Jason right now on the S2000. This is still a really new road to both of us, so uh, we really don't want to push it here. And I feel like this is really narrow compared to like, the roads that we normally drive. So it's, it's a little bit sketch, but you know, having new maps to play around with is fun. So yeah, we're just gonna see what this road is like, and you know. See what it goes from here. Damn, is he like, bro, dude? <laughs> I thought we were gonna take it easy. Jason just, goddamn, bro. Jason, <laughs> what happened to taking it easy? sketch out by this road I mean new road right so take it a little bit easy but we're gonna test the car's limit as well and this road I feel like it's a lot more technical than the one that I normally drive all right that that part is pretty bouncy that might be what Jason was talking about Apologize for the beeping sound. That's my temperature reader telling me to shift. to really like break around the corner so I'm trying to break beforehand <laughs> 